They're off and pacing Santa, happy life, first away. Puts a neck on top, they're three wide as they go in the clubhouse turn. Dax the balls is broke, stride and now trails. In and out of the turn they go, Raging Heart is now taken over, has that lead a length and a quarter, starts him down to the quarter mile mark. Moonlit Bay second, now backing off, tuck it in, Sand Happy Life is third. Mullen Hanover racing away fourth, over there fifth, Inspiration, followed by Love My Lisa, and the distant trailer decks the balls. They're at the quarter, 27 and two. They come pacing through that far turn the first time. And out on top, it's Raging Heart. Has the advantage of a length and a quarter. We'll start him in the stretch and down past the half. Moonlit Bay is second by one. San Happy Life third. Mullen Hanover fourth. Inspiration is their fifth. Followed by Love My Lisa. They're here at the half. No change. It's still Raging Heart and Walter Case Jr. They're out there a length and a half at the half. Check the time. 57 and two. They go in the clubhouse turn. Moonlit Bay sitting second, now coming back out. Here's David Miller with Sand Happy Life. Tightening in on the rail, Mullen Hanover third. On the outside, Inspiration with Love My Lisa. They're in the back stretch, going down to the three quarter mile mark. And it's Raging Hard, has that lead a length and a quarter. Moonlit Bay second, outside Sand Happy Life third. On the rail, Mullen Hanover, three quarters and one, 26 and one. On the turn, coming home. And out there with the lead, it's still raging hard. Has the advantage of a length and a half. Moonlit Bay is there, second a length and a half. Mullen out of her third, down the lane they come to the wire. And it's raging hard and Walter Case Jr. out there by two and a half. Raging Heart takes the first division of the lady in one fifty four and two. The race result is official one two exact is seventeen dollars eighty cents. Trifecta one two five eighty seven dollars and sixty cents. On the next race tonight, your tenth race, exact and trifecta wagering in the tenth race, no changes. First division of tonight's courageous lady three year old Philly stake pace number one raging heart. She's just posted her third victory of the year. She's a daughter of Art's Place out of Vegabond Heart by No Nukes. Is on by Jeffrey S. Snyder of New York City, New York. Trained by Sean Robinson, driven tonight by Walter Case Jr., giving Mr. Case a triple now on tonight's card. Trackside making the trophy presentation to this evening's first division winner. We have the chairman of Northfield Park Associates, Mr. Brock Milstein, accompanied tonight by Kimberly Osborne. And now standing by with winning driver Walter Case Jr., Mr. Dave Bianconi. Thank you, Greg Young. I'm here with uh, Walter Case, winning driver behind Raging Heart in the opening division of the Courageous Lady. It was a heck of a race for about an eighth of a mile. Uh, you, uh, Don Irvine, and David Miller all won in the front, but uh, having the rail, obviously, a gigantic advantage. Yeah, when I looked over there, the three horses leaving out of the gate, and but the two horse left with me, so that forced the three to tuck third. And uh, when I got everybody seated in, I was able to get my own fractions. That's a big edge here when you get over the half and 57 and two. I got a nice second quarter breather. Yeah, horses uh, in this kind of class going a second quarter in 30 seconds flat, half and 57. Race had to be pretty much over at that point. Yeah, I mean, she's been racing some good horses all year, and she's been racing the best. And I drew the rail here tonight and got away from Bunny Lake. That uh, that was the big plus. Yeah, you won this one uh, Wednesday morning at the post draw when you drew in the opposite division of Bunny Lake. I saw you really getting her revved up behind the gate. Uh, it looked like one or two horses might have stepped out of there a couple of steps faster than you right at the beginning, but you certainly headed them by the uh, turn. Yeah, the, the trainer told me there, the guy that came up with Robbins said that she's very lazy and you've got to wake her up a little bit leaving the gate because... She just gets a little lackadaisical, so I had to stir her up a little bit. But when I got her mind on business, she was uh, she was alert. Going to do the same with Pleasure Chess. She looks like she could use a little uh, ed, uh, urging at the start too. She really doesn't leave well at all, but she does have the rail. Yeah, I haven't talked to the trainer on that on that horse yet, but she doesn't show a lot of gate speed. But uh, I'm going to try and force her out of there as much as possible to try to get the trip. All right, congratulations, Walter Case and owner Jeff Snyder. Same combination that won this race last year with. 
Michelle's Revenge, and of course, Sean Robinson and the Robinson Stable, the connections of Raging Heart. Thanks.